What up, Internet? I'm Young Guru, and welcome back to Bloodborne. We got two new people in our home. Oh, hello, dear. You weren't lying. This is a safe place. Thank you. I'm in your debt. Curtsy. I'd like to tender my thanks, but I haven't much to offer. All I can give is my blood. But would you even take a horse blood? Oh, good. Come close, dear. Don't worry. This isn't the first time. <laughs> blood of Ariana. Oh, hello. Sorry, dear. You're much too eager. I've only so much blood, okay? So, she, along with one other person, will give you special blood. Blood taken from Ariana, Cathedral Ward Woman of Pleasure. The sweet blood of Ariana restores HP and temporarily speeds stamina recovery. A member of the Old Healing Church would know that her blood is similar indeed to precisely what was once forbidden. Very interesting. Uh, I think the other one has gradual HT HP restoring powers. Ah, oh, you. The swindling off-comer. Did you really think that'd work? There's no fool in me. Now, off with you. You heard me. Go away. I can't stand the stench of your lying breath. I'll spare you one nugget of advice. Beware the blind man. There the beggar sits at the bottom of the bloody food chain, and then his ear acting like he owns the place. He's not to be trusted. What's he want with all those people anyway? That little weasel has a murky past, I'm telling you. Oh. Give it a rest, please. I've no time for your petty lies. So that dude, whatever he says is a lie. So the beggar is actually quite nice. You. Yeah. No, she's she hasn't become friendly yet. Let's see what you had to say. Ah, oh, the hunter. Thank you. So that old man, you told him about this place, right? Well, he don't offer me much in a way of conversation, but still, I'd rather see him alive anyhow. And I was sort of hope that my asking you turn out to, you know, help him out in the end. I've never been any use to anyone, you see. Just happy about it, is all. <laughs> what a weird dude. If you find any, send him a lot to her. <laughs> okay. I think we gotta reload the place to get him to talk about uh, Ariana. So we'll talk to him about her later. Run past all the enemies. This could be really dumb. But maybe not. We're gonna go to Hemwick now. There are two things we could do. We could fight. Oh, shice. Ah, oh, damn, 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 damn. Oh, we go forward, but we're not gonna do that. Oh, we're gonna run away. There's an item somewhere around here. Tucked away behind one of these statues. Maybe not. So we're gonna get a hemlock. Ooh, bloodshot eyeball. That's actually kind of nice. Ooh. And I'm also gonna just flip this camera around left and right. Welcome to Nausea. Both hunters' marks. I think I'm going the correct direction. I did not want to pull back that much. Graves everywhere, by the way. Yeah, Hemwick. Nice. Uh, we also upgraded our weapon. It's now plus five. At plus six, we get our third gemstone, which will be so delightful. Yeah, we can do Hemwick, or we could do the Vicar. I'd rather do Hemwick. There are gunners everywhere here. I forgot about that. Oh, you're not one-shot kills anymore. 
bone marrow ash. That uh, makes your bullets stupid effective. What do you get? Murked by one of these. Oh, crap. Oh, get. Oh, God. What the hell exploded? Oh my lord, that was risky. Cold bloods, cold blood, bone marrow, ash, we have maxed out already. There was a dog fucking around here. Trying to get me killed. Just lots and lots of dodging. Not dead. So if you are at all worried about your Quicksilver bullets, you'll be doing fine. I think the path up here doesn't go anywhere? Oh, it's, yeah, it's a fake path. You can actually see the line. I thought there was a path up. I must be mistaken. I feel like I hear somebody creeping up on me, too. Dogs? Oh, there you are. Hello. Yeah, and look at that beast. Very terrifying. Also, if you roll into an enemy, maybe not. Thought it was a guaranteed stun. God, I, I forgot how crowded this opening room was. So many bloodstone shards. I guess we're getting to the point where the game wants to make sure you got a plus three weapon. Shaboom. Okay. Now we're gonna get a lamp. No items back there. Look at that mug. Crows. Ka -ka! If I remember correctly, it actually gets easier from here on out. Could be wrong. Could be very wrong. Let's go deal with some witches. One shot on these fools. Do I one shot with an R1 though? Oh, so damn close. Yeah, none too pleased with me killing them. Ah, another eyeball. I need one more of those. Or something. Ah, oh, twins. Delightful. Should be one more enemy. Maybe not. Okay, that puts it at five. We need eight shards to be happy. Madman's knowledge. Delightful. Did you hear the graveyard murmurs? Then it's almost time. Oh, I can't wait. I just can't wait. <laughs> Do you hear the graveyard, Dennis? I just... 
Huh. This will become a shortcut. Can't decide what that person's excited about. Part of me thinks she might be one of the witches, actually. That we will confront later on. Oh, hey. Hey, sweetie. Jump attack and a Molotov chucker. Twins. Oh my god, we only need two more. God, evil. Just hammer. Bro. You're not dead. Blood vials. Do -do. That's just the other path up. Yes. Dino might. There you are at. 581. Good lord. Has some strong. So this eventually becomes pretty short. You get a you can open this gate, which will be delightful when it happens. I think the path around actually isn't that much longer. It's just enemy ridden. These little makeshift shelters going on around here. Oh, you witch. Should have known that was coming. What is crows? Always crows. Wow, that was just a ton of damage. Uh, first time through the game, I found these crows to came out of nowhere. After you've played it, you have a slightly better sense of their presence every fucking where. That's path forward. Ah, uh, here we go. This is my shortcut I was talking about. Whoop. It's just where we're at. Cool, cool, cool. And I think I feel dumb. One of these crows actually was a little unique. But I killed it in a fit of rage. Oh, you're trying to shove me off the edge. You are the worst. Careful with your halberd, lady. Getting all off kilter. Bone marrow ash. What up, stone row? Oh, no, no. Don't fall off the edge. Whew. I feel like that is one of the biggest risks in this area. Blood vials. Always good when you end up not losing blood vials in a run. Also, this is creepy as shit. I also think it's clever. They force you to not be on. Holy lord. Your kind of trick hand weapon. Like trying to walk through here with this super dark. Also, let's take a listen. Hear a little creaking up there. Always pays to be observant. Big fan about how the game just kind of Gives you hints. Something's up ahead. By up ahead, I mean back behind. What 
Could it be... Dude with a big old blunderbuss. Ready to ruin your damn day. More knowledge. I also like that. A depth blood challenge. Bloodstone. You don't really notice it going this way, but then on the way back, you'll catch it. Nope. Ah. Oh. Just a really, really good level design. I think. Oh, hello. This is a trap. I know it's a trap, but I want it. Huh. Not a trap. Nice. That's the third eyeball. Twin bloodstone shards. Delightful. I love how, like, trees are coming through these buildings. Very, like, Brothers Grimm, maybe. Also, Castle Kanehurst. Off in the distance. We'll be going there eventually. God, that shove is super damn quick. Also, delightful. You know there's an item there before you even get to it. It does burn. I would not recommend rolling down there. I don't know why. I just think I tried that once and I got just wrecked. God, that follow up is phenomenal. It's like a supercharge and then drop that hammer. Blood vials? More blood vials. I thought I saw an item to pick up. Nope. Uh, there is. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get mugged. With fire? No, I'm not. Delightful. It's the gate. Can we? Ever so slightly, you can see her waiting in the wings. Holy shit. That was dumb of me. Ah, the transition shot. Not realize that dude was just gonna be ready to go. Kind of really don't want to be fighting this dude right now. Thank God. Okay, before we get out of hand, let us open said gate. Hey, girl that fell down. It's the end of your life. Someone's following me. Where the fuck you starting at? Ooh, shite. Oh, there's more than one of you. So a wee bit intense. Bloodstone shard. 
Bone marrow ash. We're going to have to pop back up to see if there were any items up there. God, I hate these Molotov throwers. Good, you're dead. Now we're safe. Whew. Alright, I think we're safe for now. I think all the enemies down here are dead. Thick cold blood. And... Come on. The moon or something. The lake. Just hop back before we get ourselves killed. Oh, wow, that's explodable. Not good. Okay. No other items over here. Let's deal with that. Okay, we did open that gate, which is super important. Nice. It's a one shot. So many graves. Oh, you are just gonna trigger. Shite. Love this sword. Sharp bloodstone gem. Treasure chest. Ooh, a triangle gemstone. Delightful. And up we go, I think. Ooh. Someone's got a come up from the grave in here, I think. Madman's knowledge, there you are. Ooh. Nope, 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 nope. Twin bloodstone shards. God, love that physics engine. Ah. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna do a, a cut after I spend my souls. And we're off to the races. Running past all our enemies. Woohoo! Back to the Hemwick Charnel Lane, witches. We've added quite a bit of fire to our weapon, which is always nice. Ooh, not today, lady. God, you're sturdy. All right. I do like the fact that when you walk into these areas, you don't walk through a fog gate to start out with. I mean, you kind of know this is going to be an enemy. Still fun. So interesting. If... Where are you at, witch? If you have no insight, the witches can't summon... Minions. So if you're struggling, consume your insight. Um, where the, there you go. No. Oh, that means she's going to be nearby? I forget how this works. i got to find her. If you get physically close, she'll show up. There you is. She, look at that. Covered in eyeballs. Ooh, she ran away. Oh, okay. Yeah, forgot about that. Faint red glow means can tell where she's at. Ow, 
what the shit? How do you handle this? Oh, it does stagger you. Oh, wow, you need a fifth hit. Ah, oh, good, delightful. God, I wish I had just a little more. Oh. There you're at. So that's her sister or whatever showing up. Assuming the witches are ladies. So they regain HP fairly quickly. It's a trade-off between killing their minions and killing them. Shit. So the game basically requires you to kill them fairly close together. Let's try to get our, our stamina back. Oh, I forgot about that. That power is horrific. There it is. Oh, shit. They lock you down and try to scalpel you, which is, it's actually like one of the most brutal looking attacks in the game. Okay, which one down? Where is the other one? Back here. Good, and the witches are dead. Okay, whew. Oh, four eyeballs. Delightful. Okay, that's where you get those items for the upgrades. Collect that lamp. Eyeballs are used in the chalice dungeons. Exquisite eyeball removed quickly after death, or perhaps even before. Used to unlock the seal of the old labyrinth hinter tombs. Those are good for farming items and what not. And, you know, if you're struggling with the main game, top over there. That's a good way to gain experience. Please carry on in my stead and let us cleanse these foul streets. Rune Workshop Tool. Which is... There we go. Runesmith Carol, student of Bergenworth, transcribed the inhuman utterings of the Great Ones into what are now called Carol Runes. The hunter who retrieves this workshop tool can etch Carol Runes into the mind to attain their wondrous strength. Provost Wilhelm would have been proud of Carol's runes, as they do not rely upon blood in any measure. Let's quickly demonstrate the Carol runes and then call it an episode. Up into the workshop. Also, let's see if anybody wants to talk to us. Up in the workshop right here, finally. Yeah, that thing is blood soaked. Terrible rituals have been performed here. Okay, Max Piles held. Quicksilver up four. More Blood Echoes from Visceral Attacks. Physical Damage Reduction plus three. Nice defense. Those usually aren't that great to use. Oh god, none of these are really worthwhile at all. 
There's that. Eventually you get things that are uh, increased stamina, increased vitality, increased experience. Uh, and then the oath. You got memory and oath. Oath are your... What's it called? Covenants. There we go. Oh, Lawrence. What's taking you so long? I've grown too old for this. Of little use now, I'm afraid. Oh. Okay, he is just saying the same thing. I think we need to defeat the Vicar to get him to open up with new text. So with that, I'm Young Guru. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time.